TR, first day of practice, 2018 season. How excited are you, man? Well, I think it's uh, everybody's always excited to get out of the first day. I think I think when you have such expectations for the upcoming season, um, you got a little bit more uh, bounce in your step, a little bit more excitement. So I think that's a, a big key because this team does have a lot of high expectations, and we're embracing those expectations. And you know, we're going to play with a lot of energy. And today's going to be an energy day. There's no doubt about that. Yeah, we see the motto, seen it uh, since November on the back of the shirts, hashtag unfinished business. You said the guys came up with that, and with these expectations, talk about how you embrace the challenge and approach that challenge of being the number one uh, pick team. Well, I think I think that exactly right. We have a theme this year is unfinished business. Um, we had a good solid year last year, but we didn't finish up the way we wanted to. So we got, as it says, unfinished business for this year. And I think for us, you know, going into it, it's it's our focus. Um, you know, the expectations again. We're embracing our expectations, but these guys got to focus every single day, and we got to make it happen. All right, it's just not going to happen just right now. Maybe on paper, or there's some publications that that think we we may have a pretty good chance of having a good season. But we have to come out here and make it happen. And we're not sitting back. And we're actually, like, just like today, we're getting after it today. And I think that's the key is that we have to make it happen. Uh, as with any team, I know you've got special guys you'll be leaning on. Uh, can you just speak to who some of those guys are this year? Well, we, we have a lot of experience coming back. Uh, I, I think the first part you look at, I think the, one of the strengths of this team is going to be experience, especially in the pitching staff. Um, we got 29 out of 34 wins coming back. Um, right now, we got three legit starters that we feel really good with. We're going to have a strong bullpen. Um, we feel like we're going to have certain roles for certain young men that they're going to thrive in those positions. Um, each one of the guys, what they have to do, they have to embrace the role that we put upon them. So I think that's key. Um, position player wise, we got some experience there too. Seven out of nine starters are coming back last, uh, from last year, so I think that's key. Uh, Mitch Byers has a lot of innings under his belt. He's a three-year starter. Um, you know, uh, Jake Sullivan is a two-year starter. Brandon Fight's a two-year starter. So we got guys that have a lot of division one experience under their belt. So hopefully that's going to be a key for us also. Coach, uh, and, uh, just talk about, uh, you know, we saw the uh, number of kids out here last Saturday for the uh, your annual uh, free winter clinic. And just talk about getting that community involvement and support out here at the ballpark. Well, I think just overall with Winthrop University, the athletic department, and, and our program, it's about community service, about giving back. And, and, and what, I, what I told my players before that is that you had a chance to impact at least one young man or one young little girl uh, in that uh youth clinic and we had close to 150 young people out here um, it's just part of the excitement of this program how the program is moving in the right direction I feel it's moving upwards so I think that's just an indication that that we were able to make connections with people in the community and, and again that's part of the life skills we teach here uh, not only with the university and the athletic department but with the baseball program also what does it mean to have a bunch of people out here on a beautiful day for with the baseball well I think that's that's a uh, another step in the program is, is to get to even Eagle Nation out here, get the Rock Kill community out here. We have a fabulous ballpark. We have a great home schedule. Uh, 28 home games, have some really good teams coming in here. And you're going to see a good product on the field. And I think that's going to be enjoyable to come out here and, and watch a great ball game. Uh, hopefully the weather's going to be good early for us. Uh, not any snow like we had last week, but you know, definitely towards as we get into the early part of March, mid-March, uh, we got a good home stand in the middle of March, but uh, we really encourage uh, the Rock Hill community, Eagle Nation to come out here and support the baseball program.